as a state ambassador to in, in the Commerce Department. Uh, what's your intake? Having a soap again, having a soap opera and now being in charge of uh, uh, in, being an ambassador for for this country, a soap opera to producer. As you know, we got we, we got this clown who actually uh, has no idea how. Uh, what does an ambassador do? He has no idea. He, he has he he's never taken um, business uh, uh, international business. He's never done that. He's just a, he's just a producer for a soap opera. Well, you know, if first off, if you've never taken the classes, um, you shouldn't be running our country or being an ambassador anywhere. But in the school classroom and having your ass in the seat and taking classes. Sorry, you have no business running a country, a department in the capital. You have no business, no business being there. Um, you know, I'm sure you're part of the um, crazy clan there in, in D.C., which we all know is crazy bus material. Um, I'm sure you're part of that. Um, hopefully that God will deal with each and every one of you, those of you that are Christians, which I highly doubt, which anybody is in the government, um, just from what I've seen in the monkey shine, you know, monkey do crap. Um, but no, he doesn't have any business running our country. Um, he needs to sign himself up for Americanism, business classes, and he needs to be sitting in the classroom, not in the government. Sorry. Uh, another question for you, Amy. Uh, you know, can we send this crazy bus down to uh, um, uh, Club Gitmo? We send it down there, you know, to... Uh, um, down to Cuba, you know, or uh, or the we're holding these guys prisoners down there. Can we actually send all the you know the bomb regime, you know, the, you know everybody else is running the White House? Can we send them down, send them on a crazy bus and send them down and send them down there packing? Exactly, that's what we need to do. We need to send them packing. Um, the crazy bus just needs to leave Washington. Um, preferably the whole crazy clan, whole. Climber's administration needs to go on the crazy bus along with crazy himself. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Sorry for the interruption, folks. Um, anyway, um, yeah, the crazy bus just needs to leave Washington. Um, it needs to take every part of the government, you know, every crazy official that was elected by crazy, crazy boy himself. Um, yeah, they need to get on the bus with shackles, handcuffs, orange jumpsuits that says kick me on the back, and they need to ride like, crazy bus down to Guantanamo Bay, get off, and they need to, uh, the guards need to take the ones they have, or all of them that have kick me on the back, and do that to get them into their cells. Mm -hmm. And where they're going to love for life for what they've done. So, anyway, on that. The next question I have for you: Can I back the bus? Can I back the crazy bus up? And and and, and uh, you, you know, want to back up the crazy bus? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you, yeah, I'm gonna take the bus on the crazy bus. Hey, go ahead. If I want to back up the crazy bus again, and then and back it into the IRS building. That's what I want to do. Knock <laughs> <laughs> that building down. Right. Give it a nail on the head with backing the crazy bus up to the IRS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, back it up all the way. Up down every piece of the IRS building you want to bust out because they are screwing every American. Yeah, throw them off and the then, cliff. Um, yeah, throw them off our money that all of us have earned, uh, whether it's, you know, today, yesterday, or, you know, a year ago. Um, Uncle Sam's going to have his hand in the cookie jar. Well, guess what? No, I think um, all of you that have checking accounts, I suggest that you go to Walmart and you cash those checks, and you hide the money at your place, somewhere mm -hmm. buried, um, cookie jar, um, preferably somewhere other than a cookie jar. But keep cash at home. Make sure you keep firearms at home as well. Right. Because crazy people do crazy things. Right, yes, they do. Crazy boy, and crazy boy is one of them. Um, yeah, but the, the, the IRS, yeah. We need a demolition team, so if anybody wants to demo the, uh, the IRS building, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure Clint Eastwood would agree. <laughs> I'm sure Chuck Norris would agree. Um, I'm sure many people would agree for that fact. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's, it's just crazy that 
I that our IRS is screwing us. Yeah. Um, you know, and on that note, screwing, um, yeah, they're screwing the veterans. Mm-hmm. Um, I think they owe every veteran, every active duty, every military family, uh, they need to put up or shut up. Right. And they need to pay up. Right. Um, this $100 every year taking off a veteran or an active duty paycheck, um, bullshit. Coming to a stop. Crazy right. bus 